but I am here for it and taking advantage of it as much as I can. Hi everyone, this is Charm again from Ready to Adult Philippines, a channel about personal finance, entrepreneurship, and adulting how-tos. A few weeks ago, I did a What I Spend in a Week cashless edition with GrabPay, so I paid all of my expenses with GrabPay. So I found out from that video that not all of you guys know pala that GrabPay is a complete e-wallet and it's quite powerful and ang dami pa niyang perks and rewards. So you guys know that I love a good life hack, so today I'll be talking about GrabPay in detail, what its features are, and how you can utilize it to its full capacity. This video is indeed sponsored by GrabPay, but you guys know that I keep these apps reviews as honest and transparent as possible and GrabPay gave me full liberty on the content so without further ado let's start the video Okay, so first things first, what is GrabPay? GrabPay is actually the e-wallet inside your Grab app. It's basically a platform with a variety of cashless payment methods. You can pay your bills, transfer funds, pay online shopping transactions, food deliveries, groceries, and more with GrabPay. It is licensed and regulated by the Banco Central ng Pilipinas or BSP, so you can be sure that they are up to standard with the BSP for financial transactions. So first is how can you load or cash in your GrabPay? GrabPay actually gave us a lot of different cash in options and it's very easy once you set up your GrabPay account. For you to do that, if you already have a Grab account, it's actually very easy. It's actually in the bottom middle of the app called Payment and you just have to submit some information to confirm your identity like an ID, you need to do your KYC, and of course you need a mobile number attached to your account. After you set up your GrabPay account, you can click cash in and they have several options there for you. First is e-wallets with Instapay. So this is where you can transfer from other e-wallets. This is perfect if you don't have bank accounts just yet or you don't want to link your bank accounts. Another method is online banking with Instapay. Go to your bank's app or website and cash in from there. They actually have instructions here for you. They have for BDO, BPI, Metro Bank, Security Bank, and Union Bank. But if you don't see your bank listed here, here, it's okay as long as your bank transacts with Instapay, you're good and you can still transfer to GrabPay. The next option is by linking your bank account. So instead of going to your bank's app and transferring to GrabPay, this you can just cash in directly through the GrabPay app. So you can either link your BDO, BPI, or Union Bank bank account. Next is by cashing in through credit card or debit card. This is my personal favorite. I love this because I can earn points or rewards with my credit card. My personal favorite is a city credit card. And I know that City also has a Grab credit card. If you want to apply to a city credit card, then I will link it down below. You can apply also through this link. But basically, I'm earning points for my Premier Miles, which I can use for travel and dining out. And also, so when I use my Grab Pay for my online purchases, I also earn Grab Rewards. We'll be talking more about that later. But yeah, this is my personal favorite. So lastly, you can cash in via SM Business Center, 7-Eleven, Cebuana, and more. And they're very accessible. So if you really prefer to cash in over the counter, you can also use this option as well. So this is great for people who don't have access to a credit card or debit card and they need a card for online transactions because once you upgrade your Grab Pay to premium, you actually have access to a Grab virtual card. Again, we'll be talking more about that later. But basically, if you have transactions online that will need a credit card or a debit card because there's no COD option, then this is definitely a great alternative. So now let's talk about the features and what you can do with your Grab Pay. First, you can use it for fun transactions. Transfer. Right now, GrabPay doesn't charge anything for fund transfer. So like any other e-wallet or digital bank, you can transfer, receive, and send money through GrabPay. So this is a great alternative for small businesses who only accept cash, especially because I know that a lot of you have the Grab app anyway because that's what you use to book the drivers for deliveries. So the send money option allows you to transfer money to another GrabPay wallet, bank accounts, or e-wallets except for the money that you got from a credit card. So the GrabPay wallet is smart enough to identify that this amount of money came from a credit card so you can't use it to transfer money to other people or to other bank accounts but you can still use it to pay for online purchases and to pay bills. Another feature is to receive money so you can either let other people scan your QR or you can send them a payment link 
So when they click on that link, they are redirected to your account. So people don't really have to know your mobile number for them to send money to you, which is actually something I really like because I don't like randomly giving out my mobile number to everyone. Next is another feature that I often use and it's bills payment. So as of making this video, they don't have the widest range of billers, but they do have the basics or the most common utilities like water, electricity, telecom, and other bills that you might need to pay and paying through your grab pay is way more convenient than physically going to a payment center. The next feature that I always use is the virtual grab pay card or the digital debit card. Like I mentioned earlier, once you get fully verified and you are in a premium account already, you get access to the Grab Pay card. It's a master card so you can use it for online purchases. So I love this and I would recommend this for people who only use a debit card because using your debit card for online transactions is not the safest because it's so hard to dispute as compared to having a credit card. Now, if you don't have access to a credit card just yet, using your Grab Pay virtual card would be safer for you to use because you can just load what you are going to pay in your grab pay and use the grab pay card to pay for your online shopping like Lazada or Shopee or any other platform that needs your card payment. So basically, the added level of security is something that I really like. I don't keep much money in my grab pay because it doesn't really earn anything in interest. So whenever I need to buy something or I need to pay bills, that's the time I reload it. So again, since it's MasterCard, you can use it with any online merchant that accepts MasterCard, which I think is anyone. So you can use it either locally or worldwide. Speaking of worldwide, GrabPay is actually very transparent in sharing with us that they actually have very competitive forex rates if you buy from online stores abroad. So if you shop from international merchants a lot, then you can also consider using your GrabPay card for that as well. So next is the scan QR option. And I don't know about you guys, but I barely bring cash anymore whenever I go out. I just get really paranoid holding cash. I have to disinfect it and everything. So it's much easier to have contactless transactions like when you are using your grab pay. So it's actually very straightforward. You just scan the QR from the merchant. The amount is already inputted. You just have to swipe and your transaction is completed. So if you watched my previous video, I got to do this because I needed to buy some stuff in the SM store. And lastly, of course, you can use your Grab Pay with all the other Grab services in the app. So Grab has come a long way since their car booking service. They now have Grab Food, my personal favorite, Grab Mart, Grab Express, Grab Car, Grab also sells load, grab public service, grab shopping, and many more. It's so much more convenient to pay with Grab Pay when transacting with Grab Services because it's their in-house brand. You don't have to do COD or you don't have to keep on inputting your card details every time. Okay, now let's talk about some Grab Pay life hacks. I know I've been teasing this in my stories the past couple of weeks and I've been really enjoying this Grab Pay hack. I mentioned this briefly earlier. So there are two major hacks that I love using my Grab Pay for. First is fund transfers. The banks are already starting to charge fees for fund transfer either via Pesonet or Instapay. And I love how Grab Pay is still not charging anything and I hope it stays that way for the foreseeable future. So basically, whenever I need to transfer money to other people and they don't have a bank account or an e-wallet that I have access to, I, so I love using my Grab Pay for that. And again, it's Instapay, so it arrives instantly to whoever I'm sending the money to. Next is my favorite, which is the double points thing that I was talking about earlier, wherein basically I reload with my City Credit Card. So they actually had a promo wherein every 2,500 pesos spent, I get a free yellow cab so that's what I reload every time I load it by 2,500 so I get a lot of rewards and when I use my virtual grab pay card for online shopping or anything that I need to pay online then I also earn rewards so we'll be talking about rewards next but basically this is my favorite life hack right now it's rewards on top of points on top of rewards which you guys know that I love so next let's talk about grab rewards grab rewards is their in-house loyalty program and of course you can earn from grab services but not just that you can actually earn faster if you use your grab pay in paying for online merchants so you can't really earn grab rewards when you are paying bills or transferring money to other people but you can use it when you are purchasing or buying something online 
So there's a complete list on their website of transactions that do not earn Grab rewards. I will just link that down below. So I'm currently in the gold reward status and I'm very proud of that. And the reason that I got there so fast is because of the Grab challenges. So this is another feature of Grab rewards that I really love. They give you challenges for you to try and accomplish like cash and money to your Grab Pay or pay with your Grab Pay and instantly you get a huge bulk of rewards. So I just recently earned 7,500 Grab Rewards points because I completed the Rewards Millionaire Challenge which I think is every month. I completed 30,000 pesos cash in and spent 30,000 pesos as well and I know that it sounds like a huge amount but I just used it for all my bills, the groceries and everything in between that I already needed to spend anyway. So I got Grab Rewards points for something that I was going to pay for anyway. But they also had easier challenges. For example, they had this challenge before wherein you can get 250 Lazada voucher when you complete a Grab food transaction using Grab Pay. So that's pretty easy, right? And it's pretty fun. You get rewards and you get to spend on things that you were already planning to spend on anyway. So I mentioned earlier that I'm currently in gold. They have the member status, the silver status, the gold status, and the platinum status. The higher tier you are in, the more perks and rewards and the faster you can earn grab rewards so i am aiming to get to platinum status before the year ends so hopefully i can get there so the points are actually based on every 100 pesos spent they have this chart on their website so you can screenshot this part so that you can analyze how much you'll be earning for transactions that you are going to make next is that your grab rewards basically don't expire as long as you have a transaction every three months so they have a visual representation of this over on their website. I'm just going to put it here. So as long as you keep it active every three months, then you are good with your Grab Rewards. And lastly, when it comes to claiming products, like I mentioned in my previous video, I'm aiming to get the Apple products, which I know sounds very impossible. I'm around 10% of the way through, but you can also use it for discounts on your Grab services. You can use it to buy um, e-gifts from Shopee, Lazada. You can use it for um, coffee shops, food, gaming, you can even donate your Grab Rewards points. So you can check out their Grab Rewards tab on the app to check out where you can spend your Grab Rewards points on. So that's it for this video. I hope that you enjoy this walkthrough and review of the Grab Pay app. Final verdict is that I really have been loving the app right now. I think it's because they have a lot of rewards because they're a newer e-wallet. And I hope that they will consistently have these feature in the next few years. But I am here for it and taking advantage of it as much as I can. I hope that you guys do as well. So thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Ring the notification bell. And again, I know that the doting can be hard, but personal finance doesn't have to be. This has been Charm from Ready to Adult Philippines, and I'll see you on my next video.